So I'm at this middle school here in, in Zurich, and I just can't believe it. It's probably the, the absolute most beautiful middle school, school I've ever been to in my entire life. It reminds you of something in Disneyland, and look at this. It overlooks Lake Zurich, and just an incredible view. And you can see there is the city of Zurich, and it must be in a very wealthy area. Well, it surely is, but it uh, reminds me more of a resort than uh, than a middle school. But incredible. Yeah. Uh, what, what town is this? This is Zurich. Oh, we're in Zurich. And, yeah. and what's the name of this school? It's a uh, Buchholz. Okay. And, and and your name? It's Florence. Okay, Florence. And so you're a teacher here, and we were just talking about. The, the new requirements to be a teacher now at the secondary level in the, the gymnasium mm -hmm. is that you need a, a master's, yeah. right? But to be a secondary teacher in the Swiss system, you have to study, what, three subjects at least? At least, but I think it's about five subjects at the moment. I can't say really because right. I'm not, uh, I have the old education. Okay. So I can't really say how much, but I think it's five. And you can teach, what, five things or three things? Yeah, I can teach five things. And what are the subjects you can teach? Okay, it's German, French, um, drawings, um, sport, right. and, and English. Okay, but if you teach at the gymnasium, which is the, the, where the really clever kids go, yeah. right? You, you, you only study, what, two things? Yeah, one or two. Okay, yeah. and let me ask you, do the... Do teachers in the gymnasium uh, receive more money than the teachers? Yeah. And why is that? Do you know? Because they have they really um, study at university. Yes. And uh, the secondary teachers study at the PH. It's a pedagogische Hochschule. Yes. It's like a high school, but it's not it's not university. Okay. And the primary uh, teachers in Switzerland do they receive less money than the secondary? Yeah. So the higher you go, the more money you make. Yeah. And, and then if you, te you were to teach at the university level, yeah. then you would even make more money. Yeah. Are these... Uh, because you have to be a professor then. You have to, be, you have to do a... Um, how do you say in English? A doctorate. Yeah. Maybe a PhD. Yeah. Do, so do most of the teachers in this school have a, a, uh, at least a master's degree? Would you say or a no? A bachelor or a master. Ba yeah. it, okay. And then, um, last but not least, right now, is it difficult to, to get a teaching job in Switzerland? Or do they need teachers? They need teachers. They do. Yeah. And so that means enough people aren't going into education. And why, why is that? Because they can make more money doing banking and things like that? Or? No, that's not, no, so, that's not so true. So what's the reason? Um, the reason is because you can really be creative and uh, it's a, for me it's really a perfect job and you can be mother and work that's right. also a reason why uh, a lot of women do this job and you were saying a minute ago hang on I'm going to go back but you were saying that if you only want to work say two days a week you can do that in yeah. or could you just do one day a week or at it least two possible no it can be it can be one day also but so you, then you are not um, uh, not um, you don't have all the from the canton, right? But from the Gemeinde. So if you just want to do two days a week or three days a week, you just basically tell your director, yeah, and they have to arrange it. If it if it's possible, it's not that you can say I I want to to uh, work three days and then he has to do it, right? But if it's possible, you can uh, work two days or three days. But your point is this is quite common, yeah, and a lot of people do it, yeah. So it sounds like it's really possible in your yeah. system. Another question. As far as the teacher retirement, is it a pretty good retirement system? Um, yeah, it's okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And, and how many years would you have to teach to get a retirement? Okay, you have to be 65 years old. 65 years yeah. old. So you have to teach up till 65. You couldn't retire before then. Okay, well, thank school, you. I, I wasn't allowed to film students because of sensitivity issues and privacy, but this is basically what... A classroom would look like and you said some teachers do use uh, the electronic yeah, overhead stuff some interactive um, some of us use the interactive programs to let, let me ask you real quick in the US one of the big pushes is to get a computer in every kid mm -hmm. every kid will have a computer yeah this is kind of the US's secret weapon to try to raise its scores yeah. uh, I'm not so sure about it 
But uh, I haven't seen this concept much in Northern Europe. Uh, have you heard a, a talk about getting a computer in? Uh, yes, there are some schools that who try to to do that, but I'm not. But you haven't heard about it as, you know, it's a big push in Switzerland. No, no, not yet. Because usually, normally work is just handmade. Right. It's not, it's not, always, uh, it's not always the best method to, to do it on the computer. That's the, my personal opinion. Yeah, the, the U.S. says, well, basically when they go to work, they're going to have to use computers and do almost everything on a computer. So that's why we need to do it in school that way. Yes, but... Well, it's, it's quite tricky to, to make mathematics on the computer. You just, well, there are some interactive programs, maybe right. you know, some multiple choice. Right. But if you have a job and you work there, you don't have, it's not just multiple choice. So you have to, 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 to know how to use the programs. Right. And that would be a separate subject here in school. Right. That's. That's why I think. So this is the front of this middle school, and you can see how beautiful their tracks are and how beautiful the whole school is. The most beautiful school that I've been to in my life. And uh, again, here's the name of the school.